Hey guys, John Jones here, Tuesday Morning Coffee. Thanks for tuning in. Today, guys, um, I've got uh, two fellows with me uh, that have started an interesting business uh, that I think is really cool, and I want to share it with you. Uh, they may be of uh, some help to you, but I've got Eric Bates here to my immediate left, and then I've got Trey Willis over here. And you guys started a company uh, called The Good News Guys, which I love the name. It's very positive. Um, your your lo your slogan is handy helpers with a heart for charity, and uh, so my first question is, what does your company do? Well, uh, to be honest, what we do anything from the <laughs> the mundane to uh, maybe maybe a little bit more, uh, any, really anything underneath what a contractor wants to handle. Right. I mean, we're going to handle those smaller projects kind of around the house. Maybe you can't get to, you don't want to get to, you don't have time for. Right. That's really what we're going to we're going to dive so into. So give me an example. Your last job, what did you go do? Uh, actually put in ceiling fans to, just the other day, I, I dug a grave for a, a dog that had passed away. Okay. So it's so anything, really all Change air place. filters. Yeah, absolutely. Light bulbs people can't get to. Absolutely. Garbage disposals. Love garbage disposals. We had a lady call us, uh, and we redid our bathroom for her. Okay. Uh, laid down linoleum, uh, reset her toilet. Okay. Uh, painted, caulked, mm -hmm. retrimmed. Uh, again, perfect, uh, perfect for somebody that that has things to do that they uh, honestly don't have time to do. Uh, Everybody has those lists. Little honey like I have lists. one right now of about probably thirty things on my house that are kind of <laughs> minor, right. but for some reason mm -hmm. I can't seem to do them. And my wife doesn't understand why. Yeah. We have a lady. I may be calling, calling the, guy, the good news guys pretty quick. So that, okay, go ahead. Well, I was going to say, we have a lady that um, that does just that. We, we show up at her house, mm -hmm. and she has a list of things for her to do. And okay. it's so weird because by the time we get done with that, she has another list. Okay. So, uh, and I think she's tabulating that while we're doing. So it's it's perfect for that tic-tac yeah. tic right. you know, mm -hmm. stuff. Well, I noticed down here it uh, you know it talks about get one and a half hours of labor for the price of one hour. That's a thirty dollars savings. Uh, receive ten dollars off per hour on all jobs over two hours. Flat rate fifty dollars appliance and furniture deliveries and install. I mean that's pretty good rates. Absolutely, we uh, you know we we did a little test market around town. Right. Um, we've never claimed to be the cheapest, but at, in the same tone, we think we're very reasonable uh, compared to what. Other people in in the market are, are charging and doing. Well, when will you show up when you say you're going to show up? Absolutely, absolutely. You, well, just, you just beat 70, 80 percent of your competition. <laughs> well, we hear that, we we hear that, and we don't we don't quite understand how people uh, are not on time, but um, we are. Uh, pride ourselves in in small things. Uh, if if anything we do right, for sure we do the small stuff. Right. I had a guy tell me the other day he was going to meet me at my house on Monday. Uh, he just forgot to tell me which Monday, you know, to <laughs> show up. But guys, y'all got a neat story. Uh, you were you were previously, as we talked before, in the beverage business, mm -hmm. the restaurants, so beverages, to restaurants. You were in the cleaning business or ran a cleaning crew. Mm -hmm. uh, how did you guys come together? How did y'all How did y'all meet? How did you get this? When did you start the business, and how did you come together? Mm -hmm. Well, actually, we uh, uh, church group together. We kind of started in a Bible study, became real close friends from there, and really felt that, you know. God calling us to do something together, you know, as far as a team, um, and really, you know, as we've been called to to be the hands and feet of Christ, and, and what we wanted to do is honestly serve people. Uh, we love to do mission work overseas, or... Y'all just got back from somewhere, where was uh, it? Nicaragua. Okay, and what were y'all doing over there? Actually, we're doing everything from building an outdoor kitchen to doing a teacher's conference, mm -hmm. and really okay. helping us people as far as... Uh, we did a youth conference and then the, the teachers conference awesome. as well. And y'all have, uh, I, I, I can tell by the, the title, with a heart for charity, uh, there's a certain, y'all do something for, um, you're, you're a business with a real social conscious, uh, a heart for people, a heart for missions. So tell me a little bit about what um, you do for charity in, in your business. Well, <clears throat> good news, guys. I'll tell you, tell you about the name. Uh, we, are, we are a Christian business. Uh, okay. If you are a Christian, and we hope that you are, uh, good news is Jesus Christ. Right. So, um, if you are a Christian, we are challenged to uh, give yourself to people, Christians and non, every chance you can, every day. Right. And, that, and that's what we want to do. We support that model by taking the profits uh, through our work, uh, 
mm-hmm. and giving those back into the community. Right. Um, we take 20% of our profits, uh, and that's net, and so not gross. Sure. So if you understand that, that right. model, you know it's, it's a good percent and give right back into the community. Okay. Places that support outreaches. Gotcha. So our support physically of uh, charities, we, we, we serve a lot of different places, but we also support financially. So from the point beginning to end, the money and the effort is all about it. Just it, it's it's a reoccurring force of giving, 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 right. all the way down the line. We and we hope that it never stops. That's awesome, man. That is so awesome. That's a cool company, a cool concept, and uh, I think you can help a lot of people, not only with your with your work, but also with with uh, your works, your mission works, and things like that. So um, I encourage you folks out there. Uh, down at the bottom of the screen, you can see their website and then also their phone numbers. If there's those items around the house, whether it's anything to do with your lawn, um, uh, ch- tree trimming, just any of those things you can't get to but you just need to get them done, these guys are perfect for it. They can do some light plumbing, some light electrical. Sounds like they can put down kitchen floors. <laughs> Sounds like they can do a lot of things. Very talented guys. Uh, serving God and uh, I just think this is an awesome business and I wish you and I feel like you will be blessed and I wish you all the success in the world thanks for being on I appreciate you guys so much thanks